is now making the jump to the stage in a new play called Beauty on the Vine, and we are so happy to have this beauty with us this morning. Thank you. Welcome back. Thank You've been you. a busy lady. Yeah, yeah. It's like everything. you got, like, everything taken care of in your career. So now theater. This now is the first theater. time, huh? Yeah, my first time professionally on the stage, and I love it. I love being in New York. I love... Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's the play. That's you. That's crazy, yeah. It's wonderful. It's a really interesting play. It's all about politics and plastic surgery and parenthood. <laughs> and it's really, it's you really know, boring topics. Really right? boring topics. covers everything. Um, and it's, you know, it's, it's not just for girls. It's about, you know, young girls growing up and what we face as problems with self-image and, and um, you know, problems with our mothers and then plastic surgery, which is a huge theme and a huge issue. And um, half a million girls in this country will have a plastic surgery procedure this year alone. Are you serious? Under 18. Are you Under serious? 18. Yeah. Wow. So we're kind Would of addressing... Would you ever do it? Um, you know, I, you never say never, because, like, who, what do I know? I'm 23, you know, I don't know what's going to happen in the future, but... Yeah, I Thank don't think you. you're going to need it. Well, it's, you know, the, the, the disturbing thing is why it's rising every year and why younger and younger people are getting it. Yeah. So we're trying to ask questions about what forces people to do it, and this is about extreme plastic surgery. Right. This is not a little Botox. These people had their faces completely reconstructed to look like their idol. Wow. So I play three different women. I play the idol and then the two doppelgangers wow. um, who are completely different from each other. So it's like a dream so role for So are you nervous? I mean, do you get nervous up there? I do. I get nervous because, you know, it's new to me, and I... I, I understand that it's new to me and I love learning from my peers but I just remember that we're telling a story uh -huh. and um, it's not a huge theater it's 99 seats so I'm, I can deal it's with 99 intimate. seats yeah, exactly. I can talk to these people um, I don't know how people do it to 2500 yeah. seats but it's it's just so fun and it's such a great exercise for an actor That's and, awesome. and good play and also uh, you were in the show The Black Donnelly yes. which I loved do you, uh, you. did you like doing a series I mean would you want to do another series yeah I love doing series like that that's you know just so many amazing actors and amazing writers I love working in New York uh -huh. um, but I, I would do another series I think that um, it's hard for unusual series to make it on network television you know we see the cable networks doing like, taking a few more risks with shows and that's really satisfying to see and and I don't know I don't know what the next step for me will be but if, if it's one, of the, TV... and one of the first steps was a kiss with Misha Barton you know we right. got to talk about that <laughs> do you can't. still hear about it do people still I do, do. OC fans still come up to you and they do. I have the young, young um, bisexual and lesbian girls of America really love me, and that's great. I'm proud. Oh, to, I'm proud to. You Everybody know, loves you. All right, now, them. including your husband, yeah. who is an Italian prince. So that he means is, yeah. Princess. Oh, there he is. Yes. So what are some of the perks of being a princess? Oh, really? We don't even acknowledge it. <laughs> no. It's so funny because we live in, in in L.A. in Venice Beach, and we live a very beachy culture. So no cares. Life, but if you go to you know, Italy, do you get? Yeah, Anything? I mean, it's great. You know, you get dinner reservations when you want to go to dinner. Well, you can do that anyway. <laughs> it's not like we ham it up at all. He doesn't even, he didn't even tell me who his father was or who his family was until I went to Italy with him for the first time. Aww. So for, we did it for three months without me knowing, which See, is that's great. Cool. That's great because you loved him for yeah, him. Yeah, for him. Thank you so much. It's so good to have you. Thank and, uh, you. And continue having fun. And for more info All on right. how to get tickets to see her in the Beauty on the Vine, it's through June 3rd. Call uh, Ticket Central or go to our website and we will uh, link you up. And coming up in the next hour, how you could uh, get a piece of wrap or 50 cents passed. But you need to have a lot of money. Totally. To triple threat. Of... Smart, beautiful, talented. Nice. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Thank you very much. Thank for being you. With us. So good to be here. Up next on the morning news, people surfing the web are going wild for Paula Abdul, right?